stuff. What? Man. What? I couldn't are you make serious? I couldn't make this shit up. Like, are you serious? Yeah. If I was going to make it up, I wouldn't have made up that shit. That, that is disgusting. Yeah. That is disgusting. What did I tell you? Uh, what did I tell you? Like, I'm not even being like like I'm trying to be modest. I can't think of any other word of saying how So mean. after we walked out the movie, who do you think was standing around talking about this shit that's like this is bullshit? Me, Alex, and Jack. Sitting there talking about this shit, and I forget what the other guy who works in the kitchen is—a Mexican dude, tall, skinny Mike. with the mustache. He was, oh. yeah, he he was talking some shit. But it's like they were comparing that shit to being worse than or worse than Thor two and fucking Iron Man three. Thor two wasn't that bad. That's what I told them. Thor two wasn't that bad. Iron Man Thor, three was, Thor Iron two Man was, was fucked. Iron, Iron Man three is a little suspect. <clears throat> Iron Man three had too much going on. A lot Iron of shit going a on. Suspect. A little, they could've, they could've, a lot going on. With and they no, could have the dropped main, the fucking Mandarin the completely thing, out of that shit. The main problem I have with Iron Man 3... Or fixed him and dropped the extremist shit out of it. Because I would have just watched the Mandarin yeah. in number three. Yeah. Straight up. Because yeah. they had already oh, they already they, planted their seeds from the beginning with the Ten Rings. They played the Mandarin. They played the Mandarin. They played the Mandarin. They played the Mandarin. Do Iron Man 3 and put in the tie into Hydra. Yeah. No. But even more than oh, that. Even more than that. Even more than that. Put in Hive, put it in the tie into Hydra for the, you know the next time. Oh, for the um, Agents of Shield tie. No, for just in general. Oh. Even even more than that, Zach. Also, the end where he blows up all his symbolically oh, blows up his, all his armors for, for the chick. Oh, and then oh. Ten minutes later. Also, they never should have hooked him with Pepper up. She's no. dumb. No. Hey, Wolf. Uh, what's your name? Uh, I forgot. Uh, forgot her name. Girl plays Pepper. Yeah, she's fine as fuck. No, I mean, she's not like, she, dude, it's not something I'm gonna like go home to lie, but it's like, the, the, there's, the, the, I mean, the, uh, the skinny white, the skinny, the skinny white girl. The fuck is, I forgot her damn name now that he said that. Thank you. Fine as fuck. She's bad. She's all right. She pretty hot. She's pretty hot. She's pretty hot. I mean, it's okay, like, okay. I will give you, I will give you this. When if Paltrow got cuter after she had a child? She, she, when she jumped in Iron Man, she just said, "Oh, that's Gwyneth Paltrow." Oh, what the fuck? That's after her baby. She ain't hot as fuck. She just, oh, okay, you'll look. Yeah, I mean, like, yeah, I mean, it's just, maybe she's because like, she's I mean, still. She ain't no. She ain't no <laughs> up and down. She ain't she's no Beyonce. Bitch. She's still skinny. Yeah, but that's I yeah, told you. Thanks. No, but no, but that's much. and that, but that's what I was talking. I literally talk. I think you guys remember Brett who used to work over there. Like we and Brett had a conversation about this. Gwyneth Paltrow was like one of the last like cool things for like skinny war girls being cool. Like that shit ain't like you feel me? That shit ain't shot off fame no more. It's 2019. He's I saw a more answer. attractive Gwyneth Paltrow at the Comic Con dressed up as Pepper Potts than Gwyneth Paltrow. No, I agree. Yes. And they look yes. about the same, but this one was better looking. She had her. <laughs> she had ass. Not not by much, but it was enough. But, I mean, it, it was, was ass, more than she had. It was an ass. Sure. That's not saying much. Billy Potter ain't got no ass. She's a, she's a bore. She's a, <laughs> back and front. I have never said there's a fine ass board. I take that board. She's funny. Days. I wouldn't marry that. She board. can be funny, but that's no. But the reason, hey, but boy, English, I the reason why you well, mad after me? Oh, 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 she, I would marry You couldn't get to Oprah. Oprah. There's a line already. I'm just saying. <laughs> you got Stedman, Gale, Oprah. <laughs> you got to get in line. <laughs> no, I think I said it right the first time. That's funny. That's how it funny. No, but uh, the reason why I didn't like Iron Man 3 is because... Oh, wait, I was doing the line. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Iron, the way he coped with the freaking Avengers bullshit is the way he was supposed to cope with it was like doing what I was just doing five minutes ago, saucing up. Cause that's what Iron No! That's what Iron Man does! He just fucking almost lost his life. I'm about to have a fucking drink. I'm not about to be like, oh, I'm gonna withdraw. So here's, talk to a kid. Here, here. Well here, no, here's the thing. thing. Is he, this this is bullshit though. This is that kid shit I was telling you about. Same thing with the fucking Punisher. Yeah. Threw a kid into the second season and try to soften him up. I don't want my Punisher soft. Exactly. Same thing with Tony Stark, but I get what's happened with him. Yeah, but they demon in, did Demon in a Bottle light in two, so they can't... Have Robert Downey Jr., what is he? Sober. Alcoholic. 
So not he's not going to be in a movie drinking. No, nah, he's but a drug no. addict. No! Drug he's addict not. and alcoholic. Are you playing fucking Robert Downey Jr.? You're playing Tony Stark. No. He's not going to tempt himself like that, dude. Oh, Get the fuck. Man. Look. Hey, Come look. On. Look, not. Ben Affleck played Batman one time and went back. <laughs> Fell right off the wagon and went back. What you think going on, dude? You you can't play with some fucking demons, dude. You just can't. You can't open the door he's again. A demon in the bottle in two. And that's him getting sober. Uh huh. So he's not gonna be drinking in there. He's not gonna be drinking in there. If they were doing deals, no, but then he dealt with, with Avengers and he was having nightmares of fucking yeah. like. And so, so he shooting so Iron so Man. So he. How would Iron Man cope with that shit? He go. To that's the, exactly he what he did. No. He, he built fucking armors ridiculously. He just threw himself in the building at the ship. Yeah. So he doesn't drink. Exactly. Come on, guys. Don't make me sound like I'm fucking like talking on my ass right now. If your ass can talk, it's burping too, but whatever. No, but come <laughs> on, man. Like, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not saying he was supposed to be like, you got, that wasn't supposed to start with him just at the bar and Iron Man 3. For Tony Stark, the character, yes, he'd probably drink. For somebody playing it live action who is a recovering alcoholic, drug addict, he ain't doing that shit in the movie. That's out. It's not fucking happening. He ain't been through fucking too goddamn much to even try to tempt that shit. Best believe. Best believe. The closest you're going to get to seeing him like that again was in Iron Man 1 when they pulled that shit out of his chest. And I'm like, oh, look, it's old school Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> yeah, that was him. That was as close as you could get. He's not trying to go back there. He was gross for a minute. He was gross as fuck, but it looked like reminiscent. Like, dude, this is less than zero? I think I've seen this before. Was this, was, is this that. the Inquirer I cover? That. Oh, I shit. That. But it was like, all I know is like, I remember the scene where it's just like he's having a little nightmare about like all the shit when he like flew into like the the void or whatever and didn't know if he was coming back or whatever. And like, what does he do? Does he like, does he like, he like, he starts shaking, you know, like he like, just, he doesn't even smoke a cigarette. He, just, he starts like compulsing or something. Like he's like, mm. no, that's not what Iron Man would do when he's like freaking out. He would literally go to his bar, pull some freaking Grand Marguerite out, and like be like, fuck, like I just almost fucking died in fucking space. That's what Iron Man would do. You're you know, right. That, Iron Man in the comic would do that shit. Iron Man in the is, like, real perfect, world. Right? And I feel like, it's like the they didn't want to show kids. They didn't want to show children. Uh, uh, Fixing their problem with alcohol. That's what I felt. That's what I felt with Iron Man. So like they didn't want to show this grown man handling his business how he thought the best way as a grown man would be, whether it be right or wrong. That's how he thought Iron Man was thought he was going to handle it. He wasn't handling shit. He was he was trying he was to suppress it because he almost freaking like 